All right, folks, I'm making this video right after I made the other one using the meter and showing you the difference here. Now, something interesting has happened. Since I trimmed that antenna a little bit, um, according to this meter, which I know reads low, these all read low, I haven't recalibrated this one yet, I had this set to about 110 to 120 watt dead key per this meter. In reality, the dead key is probably a little higher, but we have to read off of this meter. Since I retrim the antenna, start at the truck, truck's running, um, keyed up, my dead key shot up to 200 watts on this meter. And that makes sense because, you know, you're, you're, you're changing the antenna system. The antenna was obviously more resonant, more on frequency, everything else. So it brought the dead key up on the amplifier. It makes sense. So I had to lower the dead key on the radio. Um, I, sh I should have done this before I did it. But um, anyways, we'll go ahead and turn the amp off. Turn this on the 30 watt scale. And we're going to look at radio dead key, dead, um, mic gains all the way down. 30 watt scale, radio only. That's showing a three and a half watt dead key. Um, I believe before I had it, I think I had it right about the same. I may have had it at, a, no, I think I had it right at about three and a half. So everything went up by changing that antenna. And I actually lowered this because like I say, I had a, I had a, a about 120 now I've had a 200 watt dead key with the amp on and uh, I had to lower it to I'll show you what I got it at now the, the amps also cold it it changes when it warms up But on this meter, I think we can comfortably call that, what is that, the first notch? That'd be 10, 20, no, 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 that's 20, 40, 60, okay. So that's a 120 watt dead key right there. You'll see it goes up there. According to this meter, it's probably more on an on a, on a actual good meter. So that shows 120. And that was off of uh, what this meter shows of, you know, three, three and a half watt dead key. Don't have the RF power opened up very far. Um, like I say, this meter reads low. This amp does a lot more than it's showing, but I just leave it in here. So we're on the PEP 3000 watt scale. Now I've got that same 120 watt dead key on there. Like I say, it was 200. Hello. Hello, 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 audio, audio, hello, one, one, one. That's what it always shows on this meter, right about 800. In reality, it's probably doing closer to 1,200. Hello, 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 audio, audio, hello, one, 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 one. Yeah, that's what it always shows. You're not going to get this meter to show any more stingy as can be. Everybody wants to see the RMS doesn't do a lot of RMS guys these strikers just just don't do much unless you send them out and get stuff done but I went ahead and put it on the RMS for everyone so here's gonna be the dead key same dead key right 120 hello 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 audio hello 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 250 RMS 260 it depends tone of your voice I'm not worried about that number though um, like I say this meter reads low on on every level if you watched a video I did 191 where I actually adjusted this to a to a good meter you know picked up way more but more than anything I mean I'm gonna leave the amp on 
And this is what I find strange. So we're going to go down to channel, channel 1. Got the amp on. We're going to turn the RF power off, or the mic gain off. Okay. So we're going to set the SWR here with the amp on. That's right at calibration. That's channel one. We're going to go to SWR, okay? We're showing a 1.3 and a half. Look what we're showing on the striker. 1 bar. They don't jive. Now let's go to channel 40 because, you know, it's at the other end. We'll go back to set SWR. There you go. Pretty close. Let's go to SWR. Got a 1.2, right? So it's lower on channel 40 than 1. So this should be lower, right? No, that actually jumps up a bar. So that's what I'm saying. The radio shows higher. The radio shows backwards what the meter shows. These show backwards of each other. And they both show differently than what that shows. And that's running power. You know, that's running 1,000 watts PEP. Um, well, that was only a dead key, so, you know, 120. But still. Um, I mean, let's go to reverse power, right? So it, we're on reverse power, and we're going to go ahead and turn the mic gain up, just like I would normally talk here. And, I mean, let's see what this is doing. Oh, we got to go to the 30-watt scale. Reverse power. Okay. We got one. It, this shows one water reverse power. Hello, hello, hello. Audio, audio. Hello, hello, hello. There's me screaming in it. Two watts. Two and a quarter watts reverse power with 1,000 PEP going out. Um, now, we'll, now we'll look at the radio meter. Same thing. Hello, 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 audio. You know, let me go to channel 20 for this. I should be right in the middle because that's where I tuned it for. Okay, there's channel 20. Let's look at this again. Hello, 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 audio, audio, hello, hello. So under 2 watts of reverse power. Now we'll look at this. Hello, 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 one, 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 one. I don't know. You guys tell me what you think. Um... I personally think it's because the length of it, it's the jumpers. Um, I've got 12 foot jumpers running from the radio to the amp to the amp up to the meter and then the antenna out. So I'm sure those two 12 foot jumpers are playing a role in what we're seeing here, the difference or something, something's going on. But I'm going to go with this. I'm going to run it there. I saw a definite increase. And dead key power when we set the antenna based off of that. Let me check the amp. I mean, the amp runs ice cold. So, you know, now if I were to take these jumpers out, cut the ends off and null them, or, you know, get a jumper a little longer and null it so, you know, it showed X is zero and everything else, it may make all this stuff disappear may go flat but then you ask yourself is it really going away or is it just hiding it i really don't know the answer but i thought this was a good experiment to show you guys i'm leaving it right where it's at all right let me know what you think